Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel. This is Tiffany from Tiffy Butter. Today I want to do a very quick um, update video on my Fellow Facts personal size in Petit Newt. Um, from my previous video, I talked about my um, current, my, my setup for 2017. So it's about two weeks or three weeks from a since then, uh, since I'm using this planning six charm. And I want to do an update video. I just wanted to talk about um, how this worked for me and what kind of change I apply on my planner so far. So this is my uh, Follow Facts personal size. So when you open it up, um, I just, under this pocket, I just put some plan with Anna's, plan with Anna's sticker set. Um, I just love her sticker. So it will see, you will see a lot <laughs> in my uh, week on two pages. And then there's nothing changing here. This pen is from Coco Daisy Kit. I just put it in here. And this is my dashboard. I have my bus schedule on top. So I won't miss a bus if I need to take the, the bus home or go to work. And then I still have the pocket. I still have some pictures and, and um, some volume paper, some notes, some sticky notes, some cards. And this is my uh, first divider. Um, this section is my notes section as I said in my video and I put this pocket to the front because um, now this pocket is housing my grocery um, receipt so I just want to put them in here as references and then this is my notes section so as I mentioned before um, at the front, those pages are the more important notes, which I want to move them. I, I won't throw them away. Um, I usually organize my notes um, about once two weeks, probably, or once in a month if I don't have too many notes. So here, just a quick uh, flip through. And then here is my messy note. As you can see, the page is already um, ripping off. I might need to organize my notes very soon. Um, just some random notes. And then is um, more blank pages from Coco Daisy Kit. And then this is my second divider. This section is my most important section in my planner. So I still have my wish list at the back. Um, so first of all, I have my three pieces of um, academic calendar from So Much Crafting. So again, most of my, I guess now, oh, most of my inserts are from So Much Crafting. So I won't talk about, I won't mention um, this brand a hundred times in my uh, insert. So I just, I will just let you know if there are any other insert that I am currently using, I will mention them uh, specifically. So the first one is year on one page, and the second one is year on two pages. As you can see, I just highlight some important dates, um, some day off, and I jot notes down in here, um, like a little reminder for myself, and I am doing um, under progressing of my yearly pull-out calendar. Um, and then I added this insert. This insert is from Peanuts Planner Co. And this one includes a calendar section, important day section, task section, and note section. So it's pretty functional. Um, that's why I want to try it out. But as you can see, I have multiple calendar already. I have my um, month on two pages. So this one, I won't jot down too many notes. I just jot down, I use the st sticker from uh, Daiso. I just jotted down my day off and if my codes offer 50% off or 40% off, I will just highlight the date. So if I need something, I might 
I will go during this promotion date. <clears throat> if it's only 25% off, I won't go. Um, so I just want to be able to know uh, when is their biggest sell. Um, and then this is this one is important day section, which I have it in my January um, preview insert. So this one is I just jot down my packages. If I know, um, for example, plan with Anna sticker. So it will be, I am expecting the deliver on uh, 4th January. So I just shut down the date that I am expecting those uh, packages. If they arrived, I will just check check the box. And then this is my to-do list for a month, but it's, as you can see, it's already packed. Um, so this to-do list is not um, quite satisfied uh, because I have just way more things to do in this month. So probably I will just print more or I will just uh, keep a blank page um, I'll just keep up blank blank page, pages at the back. I haven't figured out yet, but um, the note section is empty by now. The reason I want to try this is because um, maybe sometime I want to know when I need to pay my rent, when I need to pay my um, my cell phone plan, um, when I need to pay this, need to pay that. Uh, but honestly, I just my life is too simple. I, I think my life is not that complicated. I don't have too many things to pay or I don't have too many dates usually. I would just stay at home. So that's why it's so blank. But just for myself, I have um, a lot of things to do in this month. So that's why it looks kind of messy. But usually I don't have too many things to do. So I will try. I will talk about it later. Um, once I try next month, probably. So I will let you guys know. I will do an update video on this planner insert as well. Uh, oh, it's digital printable um, digital file. So you can purchase from her Etsy shop. Uh, I guess she offer um, physical inserts, but yeah, I will like list that list as well in the description box. And then this is my January um, important dates um, insert from So Much Crafting. And as usual, I mentioned that I will do a checker at the back. So here's the checker. I just highlight the things that I want to do in this month. And that is the, um, um, that is the checker. Um, once I finish, I will just uh, check the box like usual. And then this is my package bar, uh, package list. And then this is my month on two pages. So this receipt might go, um, go, to, go to the front uh, pocket here later. Um, so for the month on two pages, as you can see, I don't really decorate it because um, this is my functional planner. I don't really want to decorate it too much, especially on month on two pages. So here, if anything important, I will just highlight it with a an extra uh, sticky note, uh, extra sticky note, and and then I here I just jot down when I need to go Michael, how many things I bought, uh, when I need to go to post office, um, when is my inside sale extra day off or any appointments, even Fox's first reopen day and time I jot it down in here as well. And yeah, just pretty normal stuff. And if it's important, I will use other, I will use red um, ink pen to highlight the, the task. But so far, it's just normal. Um, nothing special in this month except my mother's birthday. But I highlight, highlight the day with um, stickers already. And then I have a clip in here, kind of clip my week on two pages and month on two pages back to back so I can pretty easy um, pretty uh, go to my week on, two, week on two pages pretty easily so this is my week on two pages this is my last week I guess my last last week <laughs> today's Monday I just want to show you guys how I decorate my week on two pages as I say I don't really want to uh, spend too much time on decorating my functional planner 
but plan with Anna's sticker set is just so wonderful. They have she over um, some full box, half box, and to do list with the heart. And <clears throat> I just I don't really spend too much time on decorating. Probably the whole week I just spend like ten minutes or fifteen minutes, and everything is done. And it's pretty colorful so that's why I really like her sticker set and her stickers is removable that's really important for me sometimes for decorating I'm really picky and I'm really um, messy so um, sometimes I just mess it up but it's removable because it's removable so I can just easily take it off and redo it um, again so yeah um, so for the important things I need to do on that specific day, I will have a tab on top. I usually have a tab on top. So those uh, tags are um, more important that <clears throat> I need to pay attention right away. And then um, this is this last week. Um, so I should move everything to the current wig which is this one so I will do it right now and then I will talk about it talk about my my um what is it called my planning system <laughs> I just can't talk okay so done this is my current wig, but I want to talk about my last wig. Um, I have extra things to do, like buy some gold clips. So I want to go to Staple and buy some gold clips. Um, but I just don't know when because um, my boyfriend is to give me a ride and he was sick in the last week. So I don't know when I can buy those gold, gold clips. So ended up, I just write it down on a sticky, uh, sticky note so I can put it anywhere I want. Um, if we plan to go on Friday, I'll put it here, but ended up we um, um, we don't feel like to do it and I will move to Saturday. So that's that. If I finish, I will just put it in here. That means finished. Um, so yeah, any important things that I really need to do, I will put it on top usually. Some dates, some dinner, cleaning, go to post office, pick up packages, things like that. Um, mostly, I would shut down my work time, but now it's pretty stable. I usually work in graveyard, so um, I would just start at 11. Um, and then I would just have something like laundry, I will have something like um, we need to buy pork, we need to buy meat, and um, my eBay auction ends, something like that. So yeah, this is my last week, and this is my current week. Um, as you can see, I so far I only have a few things to do today. It's not that busy, including um, film to film this video, and today I have an Insta cell that I am expecting to join. And this is the um, the so much crafting daily task is already done, so I need to throw this out and put a new one between the week. And this is my today ruler. So for extra notes, I will have another sticky notes on top of this ruler. And these bars are from so much so much crafting as well. So here I just jot down new notes or some recipe so this one is recipe um, although it's in Chinese um, because my boyfriend was sick last week so I want to make some traditional Chinese soup for him so here is the recipe the things I need and how I make this soup um, I just keep some random notes in here and there so this is this week and this is my next week I haven't decorated yet and this is my February um, them them same things goes on and on um, month on two pages and week on two pages and then i have this uh, transparent divider and then i keep the rest of my insert at the back and here is just um, the planner kit from uh, plan with anna as you can see i used most of it already um, 
It's very beautiful. I just love them. And then I have my olive clip at the back. I attached the um, the freebie from Plan with Anna and this dot um, sticker from Daiso at the back in here. So I can, if I have some add-on, I will just directly um, take off one sticker and just randomly put it anywhere in my planner somewhere like this or um, if I have more day off I will just put it in here so that's that that's my planning system so this is my third tab um, I have a big change in my third tab so it used to be my list and notes section but um, I, I realized I haven't used this tab that often so I changed it to my emotion checker <laughs> so so i only have a few papers in this tab but um i will just talk about it right now okay so this insert is a freebie from uh penis planner call i just she is so generous i have to say i will link her essay and Insta instagram down below she always over um, freebie like I guess it's monthly um, so this month she offered freebie as well I just need to download it and use it um, I guess it's a new week on two pages insert which I definitely want to try them out um, and this one is a, a yearly checker but she has <clears throat> excuse me she has two digital files in the whole file package um, the first one is f for January to June and the next one is from July to the end of the year which is December so six months on one page uh, on two pages I decorated with um, stickers washi tape and things like that so this one is just a highlight of the day um, so anything interesting happen I will just Check it down in here like my boyfriend was sick like um, we went to his parents place he picked me up um, at 4 in the morning like things like that some small things I don't want to forget because I am I feel so grateful that I have him and his family in my life right now because my family is in China so they are really my family and they help me a lot. I want to jot down a lot of things I, that I am so grateful for um, in this in this uh, checker. And of course I have my friends and I have I have so many wonderful in Instagram and YouTube friends on internet I, which I'm just I'm overwhelmed. Um, so I just like the, I, the whole idea is I just want to jot down the things we do or I see in a day. Um, it's a highlight of the day. So um, after a year or after a couple months, I will just get back to this insert and take a look. Um, just kind of like remind myself, hey, Tiffany, <laughs> you're so lucky. You are a lucky girl. Um, and I do believe so. So yeah, that's like a highlight checker for this one so the next one is my it's surely my emotion checker so um red is super happy pink is happy blue is meh means so so <laughs> and then um gray uh, or silver is terrible so i do have two days i feel terrible because i feel terrible um when my boyfriend is sick i feel so sorry for him and i worry about him um so i feel terrible in these two days um which i'm not very proud of but everyone has brew days right so yeah that's that um most of the, of the day i am pretty happy so let's keep that in mind so this is my emotion checker i feel like is very useful and functional um especially you want to keep track of your feelings or you want to keep track of the things that happen every single day is really um, convenient for you. So I really like this section right now. And then I have my forever favorite picky uh, bookmark in here. At the back, I just have some random notes. 
So, and then the next tab is my adjust it, adjust and and um, uh, books to read and favorite uh, shops um, addresses like things like that. Um, nothing changed in this tab, so I won't talk about it. So yeah, that's my current setup of my um, in my final facts. I feel so. I finally feel the planner piece. Um, people have talked about it for a long time. Now I really truly feel in that way. I don't see myself change will change it too much in the future but if i do i will definitely make another update video to show you guys what i have been changing and and what i feel about it so yeah that's that um i hope you guys enjoy this video and have a great day i will see you in the next video soon bye bye